Story select. Welcome back to Let's Play Sonic Adventure 2, Episode 12. We are now moving on to the to the dark story. My mistake. As I can see, now we can choose from any scene that we want from the hero side. So now let's move on to the dark side and get that all taken care of. Ooh, the dark side. And it starts in prison. Great. Okay, good. They're making another Sonic game. Don't let them escape. Shoo, shoo, shoo. We're not letting Sonic Boom 2 happen! Close them all! Fire and Ice will never make it to store shelves! Oh, spring release! Eggman's fucking shit up! This is not a drill, it's a gun! A drill gun? Well, I mean, maybe his drill can pierce the heavens. Never really used that machine gun again, though. We're looking for a top secret military weapon that his grandfather had somewhere in this facility, so we're gonna find it. Stage one, Iron Gate. This is about the same as Tails' levels, pretty much. Oh, okay, so... Okay, this makes sense. I didn't know Eggman was in here because I thought he'd just be running around, but no, he's he's just, like, in his little robo-egg mech or whatever. Yeah, no, it, it, it makes sense. That's, that's how he uh, is paired up with Tails, too. Gotcha. So two mechanical minds in one game. I can accept that. Yes. One is pretty smart for an eight-year-old, and one acts like an eight-year-old. But is a genius. Genius eight-year-old who acts like an eight-year-old. Oh, <laughs> he blew up part of the moon, my friend. <laughs> oh, wait, that hasn't happened yet. Technically, no. We're restarting. This is all at the beginning. Right, this is, all, this is all new. Is this before Sonic is running from the government? Sonic is just now getting arrested. <laughs> you know that that sounds so silly when you say actually, it like that. Actually, wait, he's he's now he's not even arrested right now. So he's he's just running around. He's just running around doing his own thing right now. Okay. <laughs> this is the slowest elevator. Uh, no kidding, you can't skip this. Well, if I have my hover, I probably could, but I gotta wait for that door to open, too. Okay. There we go. There we go. So, uh, refresh my memory. Did Tails do this level, or was that a different kind of kind of level like this? The dark, the dark Side story has their own unique levels. They may have the same type of locations, the same type of settings, but they're all unique levels. Hmm. So Tails has not done this, no. That's actually kind of rare today, you know, if we're retreading stories, a lot of games would just reuse the same levels, but put you in, like, a different spot. Yeah, no, these are... these are their own unique levels. That's... it's, it's really refreshing. I think that's what makes this game so... Diff so much better than the rest, because you go to Sonic 06, those really were just the same fucking levels. Oh, God, don't remind me. Just recycled. Three Dude. times. There's nothing to differentiate them. Here, at least, you know, we got... It keeps the plot going, you know. You got slow-ass elevators, you got Eggman breaking shit. But they all hit about the same notes. Yeah, I noticed that e even if this is a different level, it still semi-feels the same. Like, I'm getting a definite Tails vibe. Yeah, that's it. It, it. it feels the same, but it's not the same. And that's good, I applaud that. It is good. It's very good. It means that we're getting a whole new experience, because there's even less stages in this side. Oh, really? Yeah! <laughs> it's just not enough dark to go around, not enough edge. I'm guessing they did the hero side first, and then they kind of cut corners a little bit on the dark side story. The dark side story's still fine. It's still great. Still works, still works all right. Now we're reaching the end of the stage. Uh-oh. This has to do with that big rocket. Oh, I thought we were... Uh, uh n never mind. That, that was just a weird camera angle. It, ma it made it look like we were about to set off an actual rocket ship. <laughs> it's like, set off the rocket ship! It's going straight into these doors! This is how I'll get to space! <laughs> Hoorah! Aw, oh, I missed a chow key. Oh no! I just slammed right in the goal ring. I couldn't do anything. 
<laughs> Piece of cake. B rank, that's not bad. No, it's not. If I would have got more points and got more rings, I would have gotten a better rank. <sighs> One of these days. Get, maybe if I didn't get hit those couple times, it would have been fine. But anyway, Chow World, don't laugh. Okay. Don't laugh. Okay. Don't laugh. <laughs> I said don't laugh! Sorry. What sorry. are you laughing at? Oh my god, he's got he's got like the swagger step. Oh my gosh, he's so fast! Woo! Oh, I look looking great, Eggman. Great, great model. God, God, all he's right. got like the preening hands. He's he's just all to the side, just like, oh, let me pet the chows. Alrighty, where is he? Where'd he go? Who, the doofus chow or the good chow? Oh yes. Hello, Deji May. Deji May. Hey. <laughs> hmm. Daddy wants to talk to you for a moment. Retribution! Oh no! Die, Deji May, die! Oh no! No, that's the one I like! We're playing the dark side now, which means that Deji May gets all the abuse, and now this little guy gets all the love. Oh my god, the tables have turned! The tables have turned. This is Deji May's comeuppance. This day of reckoning. See, look, he's so confused. Wait, what's this? You're not gonna hurt me? You, you set me down gently, actually. Wait, wait. Food? Sustenance? Power? Who who are you, strange fat man? Oh, are you what mommy and daddy call child services? <laughs> you shouldn't trust a chow in the hands of hedgehogs. <laughs> Only in the hands of a genius can you raise a chow properly. I mean, we have a hedgehog, a child, and some idiot who keeps losing his emeralds. <laughs> and knuckles. <laughs> Damn it! Well, you uh, eat oh, good here. Have some fucking fruit. You gotta get your stamina because right now Dejime is gonna beat you to a pulp. Oh, these guys are gonna race each other, aren't they? Uh, more than race, they're gonna fight each other. <gasps> oh, is this like the Chow version of cockfights? Pretty much. Oh, damn. So is it going to be where Deji May is still the most powerful and he still gets his way? Or is De or is uh, the other guy here oh, going to become the underdog and dethrone just, Deji May? I was just thinking, this is so cruel. You're making your chows fight for affection. <laughs> Come here, asshole. <laughs> oh. Drink it in, drink it in. Just swat the damn thing away. Just ah, right in the wall. And so, oh, 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 mm. oh, well. Yeah, I think we're done. Yeah, here. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Whoa, excuse me, ma'am. Ah. I was just thinking, this is like the the terrible babysitter, or maybe like, how how do I want to say this? It's like that friend that comes over. It's only your friend, but anybody else is just like Pfft, whatever. <laughs> Hashtag foster care. <laughs> the ultimate weapon. Not that gamma piece of junk I made the last time. Now it's time to meet our new brother. So this is the military's top secret weapon. It's a lot smaller than I expected. It's a little rock. My Enter little brother. Uh, Enter password. Uh, let me try password. password. Mario. Uh, uh, Self-destruct sequence activated. No! Oh, that's right. Maria's part of the plot, isn't she? Yep. Part of Shadow's plot. Yerp. Oh, God. Yerp. Oh, God. Yerp. Oh. Yerp. I can't believe it. The government finally approved my fanfiction! Black Sonic! Damn STWs! Wait a minute. You're not Sonic. This is impossible. 
SJWs, what did I say? SGWs. <laughs> so goddamn worthless. <laughs> Bam! Boom! <sighs> I was just thinking this is Sega trying to be all inclusive. It's like, you know, we got a blue Sonic, why not a black Sonic, you know? There's no red Sonic. He got knuckles. This is Scorpion yeah, he's Mondo. he's the token <laughs> red guy. <laughs> I'm just thinking, you know how people make their own characters. It's that they have their own like names, the Hedgehog or the Echidna, and it's always just like a, a bad recoloring. Dude, I don't know about you, but I think Knuckles is totally ace. <laughs> totally ace, man. No, Knuckles is great. I mean, the way he looks at Rouge, there's no, there's no romance in there because he doesn't feel anything because he's totally ace, man. You don't give a fuck. So, for being the ultimate life form, this boss fight better be the easiest thing you ever do, right? Uh, I am the ultimate life form. I just need to. Wait. Wait, come here, come here. I just, I just need to hang on. Let me. Oh, okay. Well, you. There. So, what kind of a character are you making? Um, he's a black hedgehog with with red stripes, and uh, I, I put him on roller skates, and Ow. he uses guns, and and he and he cusses because he's, you know, he's like all mad and stuff because he he's the ultimate until, life form. He doesn't do that until Shadow of a Hedgehog. Well, I'm preemptively writing my fanfiction and making it come to life. Ha <laughs> ha, you're fired. Damn, not again. Wait, we have to let you go, Mr. Naka. But what did I do? I just introduced a new character that we would be hip with the kids. Well, I wonder who the most hip stay. character is right now. I mean, at this point, I think Vector is more hip now. <laughs> and nobody likes Vector. It's just like Charmy the Bee. I mean, no one likes Chaotix either, except maybe Espio. I think some people like Espio a little bit. Because he's dark and edgy too. Destroying that guard robot was spectacular. So no need to patronize me, Doctor. You are the military's top secret weapon. But what did you mean when you said you will grant me a wish? You ever see Mewtwo Strikes Back? Chaos Emeralds. It's kinda like Shut that. Away. Oh my god, he is! I'll be waiting for you. So, so not only control room is he on the space colony. You know what? I shouldn't start because as soon as I start complaining about Shadow, it'll never stop. Well, complain all you like. More complaining next time on Let's Play Sonic Adventure Deuce. Deuces. Now.